What's happening my fellow geeks and geekettes? Welcome to a brand new and very different episode of Cosplay Chris. And to be honest, I wish I wasn't making this video. As a lot of you guys know who have been following my progress with my brand new Batsuit 2.0, Batfleck Batsuit, I purchased a brand new cow from a seller on the replica prop forum known as More 5. Now in my latest cosplay update video, I did state that I did not know when the cow was eventually going to arrive. It was coming from Canada via ground mail. So God knows how long that is gonna take to arrive here. Now even before I posted that video, I did get messages now and then about people saying, I think he scammed us. I don't know if we're gonna get our cows. And it wasn't until it's brought to the attention of one of my good buddies, he messaged me on Facebook, he goes, look, I've made a claim with Etsy because that's where he purchased his cow through Etsy, and apparently he has done a runner. Now, first of all, I just wanna say this video is not dedicated to bashing this person at all. I'm just trying to spread the word for anyone that has purchased a cow from him to please contact either PayPal or Etsy, whichever one you've dealt with, because I don't think we are honestly gonna get our cows. Even though More 5 did state that he sent it via ground mail, it should have been here by now. It's been, what, two and a half months since he sent it. And obviously there are people that are in either the United States or Canada that have ordered a cow for him. If they had lived in Canada, they should have gotten the cow within one or two days. And yet, not a single cow in hand. So as of today, I finally got my money back from PayPal. I opened a claim, which eventually escalated into a dispute because I didn't want to muck around. So as of today, I got my money back through PayPal, which was really good because the cutoff time for the buyer protection was within two days of expiring when I opened my claim and eventually escalated it to a dispute. And obviously PayPal gave the other party time to respond. They gave him till the 19th and... It's the 21st, so it was over the weekend, so I had to wait, obviously, over the weekend for my money to go in. But as of today, which is Monday morning, the 21st, the money has gone in my PayPal account. I got a full refund. And if you guys are wondering what the amount was, it was 315 US dollars, which equates to, according to XC Currency Converter, 405 Australian dollars, which is a lot of money, guys. This is something that you don't want to stuff around with. And that's why I'm making this video. For anyone that has ordered a cow from More 5, and is not in the loop, please be aware that this is what's happening at the moment. So like I said, either contact PayPal or Etsy, whichever one you dealt with. And I have had a lot of people contact me and say, damn man, that sucks, you know, aren't you upset? And to be honest, no, I'm not. It's to be expected with this hobby. It's to be expected with this kind of industry. This happens. I've had it happen to me a lot. And honestly, what you can take from this is shit happens. You'll either win some or lose some. But the most tragic thing about all of this is the cow looks so damn good. It was such an accurate representation of Affleck's Dawn of Justice cow. I was number two on the list. I even put a down payment when he was still sculpting it in clay and whatnot. And he was posting his progress on the replica prop form. Then he finally put it up on the sales page. And we saw the worn shots and just looked amazing being worn. So yeah, I was number two on the list, waited forever, had to keep contacting him to get answers and updates in terms of what's happening with the cow, whether it's been made, whether it's been shipped. And then he finally said he shipped it on the 15th of February via ground mail. <laughs> really? Apparently regular shipping like via air from Canada to here was gonna cost nearly the same amount as the cow, which is just absolute Bullshit. And so he said it cost $100 to ship it via ground, which is still a lot of money. Really? So as of now, I am without a cow. Um, I have no idea which cow I'm going to go with. I do know a few guys that make some pretty decent looking cows. I'm just wanting to find one that's going to be best suited for me because I have a really small head. Most cows out there are suited for about, you know, a 24 inch head. I'm a 22 and a half. And even though it's not really that much of a difference, it still makes all the difference whether or not you're gonna look like a human bobblehead. So guys, just to give you an idea, I paid more five on the 2nd of December last year for the cow. That was 315 US dollars. I then opened a claim last week and as of the 19th of this month, the dispute was then closed. That was the cutoff date for the seller to respond. And I've now got my money back as of today, which is Monday the 21st. So guys, if you recognize that cow in the thumbnail as a cow, that you have ordered from More 5 off Etsy, please contact Etsy right away 
These guys are great in terms of fraud protection and getting your money back. They will try their best to get the money back. If you went through PayPal, open a claim straight away, escalate it to a dispute because you know what, he's not gonna respond from what my experiences has been. So you just wanna get your money back as soon as possible. And like I said, I'm without a cow, except this one. Um, it's pretty accurate. Excuse the bed hair. Oh. Um, look, this is a pretty damn good representation of Affleck's cow. So, um, this is the cow that I have for now. Um, it will probably be on the final bat suit. Um, you know, it fits me well. I will have to put the black makeup on. <laughs> And hey, on a lighter note, Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice is coming out this week. Well, this week technically for me because we are in the future. You guys in the States are in the past. Like I said, you've missed absolutely fuck all. You've missed nothing. So Thursday afternoon slash night, I will have my spoiler free review of Batman v Superman. And then sometime over the weekend, I will post a spoiler fill review, guys. So... When you are gearing up to see the movie, when you're going in with your mates or whatnot, have an amazing time, enjoy the film. For everyone that is seeing the film like today or tomorrow, our time, if you get to see it on the 21st, have fun, have an amazing time, enjoy it. And if you spoil the movie for me, I will kill you. <laughs> <laughs> So thanks very much for watching guys. Like I said, this video is just more or less to alert people that have purchased a cow from More 5 and have no idea what's going on and aren't in the loop because I wasn't in the loop to be honest. If it wasn't because of my amazing friends that actually, you know, spoke up and said something, then I'd have no idea. I'd still be out of pocket and hoping that the cow was eventually going to arrive via ground mail. And like I said, you win some, you lose some with this hobby. This stuff happens unfortunately. You're dealing with people over the internet. It's bound to happen and this is why we have buyer protection fraud protection and whatnot so PayPal did their job they did it well if you bought through Etsy contact them straight away and they will do their best to get your money back as always thank you very much for your continuing support and watching and until next time geeks please always remember cosplayers do it best